What's up guys? Welcome back to another Destiny 2 Zero video. As you can tell, we are on Titan. We are on the rig. So, I mean, he's only in a select few locations. He's usually in uh, probably the same area versus Destiny when we're traveling around. But let's check out what he has. So first up, I do want to go over the invitations of the nine. So this is going to be the first one we get. So this is pretty cool. So it says collect metaphysical samples from defeated combatants in the European dead zone, complete strike like of shadows. So it looks like you just need to complete the strike, gain samples from Cabal Fallen and Taken. And yeah, I mean, that's pretty simple. I mean, I, I am definitely excited to see what the heck these are gonna do. I'm assuming it's just gonna be more lore because we're obviously missing some lore books um, in the lore triumph section. But let's go over what else he has. So he has a Feta Ingram. This only gives you year one exotics. So if you already have them all, don't worry about it. It cannot reward for Sagan Exotics. You can only get them from the gear. Speaking of the gear, let's check out what he has. Looks like he has Crimson. This is basically the Red Death 2.0 of Destiny 2. Just quickly over the perks. It comes with Banned Weapon. This weapon fires a three round burst. Small Bore, Accurize Rounds, and then Cruel Remedy. Kills with this weapon, heal the wielder, and Precision Kills also refill the magazine. Then we have Heavy Grip. There's also a Callus you can get, which is found randomly. Uh, this is probably one of the first catalysts I got on it. It really increases the range on this thing, which is insane. So, and then there are two ornaments. There's a Curse of Sash one called Silver Bullet, which that one's nice. And then you have a more prototype version called Iridescent Death. Yeah. So, yeah, that's Crimson for you. Next, let's go over the Hunter Exotic. We have Orpheus Rig, probably easy, easily the best PvE weapon for the Hunter. So it comes with Uncanny Arrows, provides ability energy for each enemy tethered uh, by Deadfall Anchors. Mobius Quiver has more shots so actually this perk has kind of changed a little bit since um oh i think it's update 2.1.4 so let's go over the other perks comes with fusion rifle and hand cannon dexterity which gives you faster ready and stow speed for those things and outreach reduces melee cooldown when using your class ability <clears throat> then you have scout rifle scavenger and then special ammo finder there's also an ornament but you can't see it because i'm on my titan right now but if you don't have this highly recommend picking it up easily the one of the best pve exotics to use for the night soccer Going over the Titan, we have Worm God Caress. Now, let's just go over the perk before I say anything. Burning Fist. Melee kills increase melee damage for a period of time. Additional kills extend duration and increase effects. That stacks up to five times, which is pretty cool. Comes with Fusion Rifle and Hand Cannon Reloader. And then Impact Induction. Causing damage with the melee attack. Reduces your grenade cooldown. And then looks like we have Sniper Rifle and Machine Gun Scavenger. So... Uh, not bad rolls on that, but what's pretty cool is that if you actually use this with the Burning Maw and the Throwing Hammer, what's pretty awesome is that once you get that first initial like melee kill, um, the hammer one taps. So <clears throat> there is a way to actually do that with that exotic. Now going to the Warlock, we do have a Forsaken exotic. We have the Chromatic Fire. So let's check it out. It comes with Crystalline Transistor. Precision kills with your kinetic weapon. Create an explosion in the element of your equipped subclass. Looks like we have Unflinching Bow. Fusion Rifle and Kinetic Aim, so you can choose between those. And then we have Scout Rifle Reserves and Special Ammo Finder. Not bad perks. I probably definitely Unflinging Kinetic and Special Ammo Finder are key right here. The perk is pretty cool. Um, like, basically gives you Dragonfly for your Kinetic Weapon. So if you're using something like Ace of Spades, it gets double Dragonfly. Plus, if you're using like a Void subclass, like Ace of Spades is Solar and Void Explosion. So it's definitely pretty cool. If you don't have this, this exotic for the walk, it's super, super good for PvE. And it's pretty solid for PvP. If you want to check out my review, it's definitely on the channel there. And then obviously you can pick up the Five of Swords Nightfall Challenge card. We're now at the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. But there are three things I want to go over. First up, my clan, the D1 Fire Team, is looking for active players in the Destiny community. Our members play all sorts of activities from casual PvE and PvP to the end game content. If you're actively playing Destiny 2 and want the benefits of a bigger clan, the link to join is below. It'll say clan link. All you have to do is request to join and myself or one of the admins will approve you. If you're with a smaller clan and want the benefits of a bigger clan and you have like let's say like seven to ten members i'm just using that as an example but if you want to come over just send me a message on any of my social media links and we'll try to get something set up number two if you want to help support me there's a link below that says best way to support me that'll take you to a four minute video if you want to go check that out that would be awesome but if you don't want to do that you can always like this video subscribe to the channel share this video and all that good jazz if you want to do any of those things lastly we have a link to the community Discord below. Just a heads up, we're looking for anyone with moderator experience to potentially run the Discord. I know for myself, I'm more of a player instead of a manager. So if you have some moderator experience, just send me a message and we'll try to get something set up. I know for myself, I'm on Xbox, but if you guys would like to talk or chat with me, Discord is gonna be the best way to do those things. All right guys, hope you enjoyed this video. We'll catch you next time.